Oh, hi. Hello. Welcome. So kind of you to join me. Make a wish and let your dreams stay fine. Oh, do please grab your hat. We're flying. It'll be a delight. Open up your eyes to the magical skies. So full of wonder, fun, adventure, or jolly grand time. Are you ready for another story time? Delira and Xera, Chucky, take a little spark no time. Like the sun, I am going to shine. Like the voice, I'm here to sing. Like the bird, I'm here to fly and soar high over everything. That's what the young girl surrounded by her friends of different colors and cultures declares in a powerful tale. I am enough. Oh, hi. Hello. Welcome! So kind of you to join me! A wonderful Wednesday to everyone watching this video. Today we are going to review another amazing book for the little ones. But before I begin, I have to ask you a serious question. Do you know what time it is? It's time for another book review and story time with Gilbert Ian! Please don't talk about me when I'm gone. Oh honey. Our friendship from now on. To start off this video, I would love to introduce our book author of the day, who's none other than Grace Byers. So Grace Byers is an actress and an activist known for her roles in Fox's smash hit series, Empire, and Marvel's The Gifted. As a multicultural, biracial coda, that means child of deaf parents, Grace was bullied throughout her childhood which inspired her first children's picture book, the New York Times bestseller, I Am Enough, a girl power celebration for all shapes, sizes, and skin tones, an ode to the empowerment of young girls everywhere. She's such an inspiration, don't you agree? I know you're wondering why I chose this book. Well, the consistent message throughout this book is one of self-worth and embracing differences. Byers emphasizes that regardless of one's looks, abilities, or beliefs, every child is unique, able, and worthy of respect. Her message encourages children to recognize diversity and show respect and kindness to others. But I don't want to spoil this wonderful tale, so let's begin, shall we? I Am Enough by Grace Byers, illustrated by Ketra A. Bobo. Like the sun, I'm here to shine. Like the voice, I'm here to sing. Like the bird, I'm here to fly and soar high over everything. <laughs> I loved to do this as a kid. Like the trees, I'm here to grow. Like the mountains, here to stand. Like time, I'm here to be and be everything I can. Like the champ, hiya! I'm here to fight. Like a heart, I'm here to love. To climb, and like the air, to rise above. Like the wind, I'm here to push. Like a rope, I'm here to pull. Like the rain, I'm here to pour. 
and drip and fall until I'm full. I love the wind and rain. When I was a little boy, don't judge me, times were different. <laughs> when I was a little boy, my grandparents had this aluminum barrel and I would fill it with wood and light it on fire. Mind you, it was a cloudy day, it was raining a little bit. And I would wear a robe because my aunt gave me a robe for Christmas one year, I was in elementary school. <laughs> yes, I had a little robe. It was blue, navy blue. And I would wear it, <laughs> and I would stand on this chair. I was safe, I can assure you. And the winds would blow, and they would blow my robe, and it was very dramatic, <laughs> you can imagine. And I would summon the rain. <laughs> summon the rain and the gods of the wind and I would sing and flail my arms everywhere and this fire would be burning in this barrel and I would sing on top of my lungs and the winds would blow and such a wonderful thing that I remember um, I love that story I don't share it often because I think people might think it's kind of weird a child with the barrel unsupervised <laughs> yes I was <laughs> oh god guys I did so many crazy things as a kid. But of course, the times were different. Um, nothing happened to me, and it was great. Um, I just wanted to share that with you guys. <laughs> oh God, childhood. It was amazing. Like the moon, I'm here to dream. Like the student, I'm here to learn. Like the water, here to swell. Like the fire, here to burn. Like the winner, I'm here to win. And if I don't, get up again. I know that I may sometimes cry, but even then, I'm here to try. I'm not meant to be like you. You're not meant to be like me. Sometimes we will get along, and sometimes we will disagree. story when I was a kid <laughs> we used to have this thing every year in elementary school it was jump for your heart and we would compete to see who can jump rope the longest true story I know that we don't look the same our skin our eyes our hair our frame But that does not dictate our worth. We both have places here on earth. And in the end, we are right here to live a life of love, not fear. To help each other when it's tough. And say together, I am enough. Ah, I love this book. I love this book. Grace Byers, you're amazing. And there we have it. Girl power it is. Girl power. The book does a great job of encouraging girls to embrace who they are, both physically and personally. To support other women. To not be afraid of their strength or their empathy. I believe it's extremely important to teach our kids these values at a young age. The illustrations then bring out the message to another level. There are girls of every color, every build, every ability. Girls with hijabs. 
girls in wheelchairs. An absolute rainbow of young women working together, demonstrating what true friendship is, and supporting each other. We are all here for a purpose. We are more than enough. We just need to believe it. It would be a perfect gift for mothers and daughters, baby showers, <laughs> and graduations as these young women step out and take on the world. Which is why this book received my rating of five out of five stars. Five out of five stars. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to give this video a like, a heart, or a thumbs up. And don't forget to check me out on YouTube and subscribe. Bing! Did you enjoy today's story? What did you learn from today's story? Sound off in the comments below. I'd love to hear your thoughts. Till next time, please stay safe and please be kind to one another. Virtual hugs for you all. See you very, very soon. Bye! <laughs> Bye. Oh, do please grab your hat, we're flying, it'll be a delight. Open up your eyes to the magical skies. So full of wonder, fun, adventure, or jolly grand time.